I want you to shout Jesus as I invite His Excellency, Archbishop, Master Prophet, E. Bernard Jordan. Sir, you are welcome in the house. Sir, you are welcome in the house. I want you to run back and get the best seed you can get and lay it on this altar and just say, no more lack. And we're going to keep on speaking. So he tells the prophet to arise in verse number nine. What does he say? Arise, get there to Zerophim, which belongeth to Zidon, uh -huh. and dwell there. And dwell there. Behold, I have commanded a widow woman there to sustain thee. Okay, hold it right there. Um, tap my sister. Stand on your feet. You're the first one to come back. And I heard the word the Lord say. There's a word that is in your mouth because you're going to carry the word of the Lord to many. Amen. You're not only going to be a student of the word, but you're going to be a carrier of the word. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. I don't know what has happened in marriage and relationship because there's something that was a real struggle, but I heard the Lord say, you're going to marry in the will of God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. And whatever this cloud has been over you, yes, Lord. this cloud is moving because God's going back in the last seven years of your life and undoing things from 2011 up until today. Amen. The Lord says, get ready to go back to school. Education is before you. Yes. And as you do, I've already opened the door, and that's the word of the Lord. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. Yes. Now watch this. When you give your seat, I want that to be your best, because God counts not what you give. He counts what you have left over. You didn't get it? I know. She's supposed to get 20,000 rand a day. She didn't get it. She don't know why. Because you wasn't going to give it to God. So what are you going to do with it now? You going to do it? I'm going to give it to God. Say it out loud. I'm going to give it to God. 